Hello, how's it going guys? Thank you for watching. For this video, I'm going to do, we are going to do a keto taste test on this right here. It's the Stoka Nutrition Cocoa Almond Bar. It says right here that it's four net carbs and it's uh, all natural. It's more like a protein bar. I got this one out of the May Keto Crate box. Right now looking at the website, it says that it's worth $2.99 which is a little expensive, but I tend to say that for all the products coming out of, of a keto crate. So considering shipping and handling, uh, it's not terrible. I'm getting used to it. Also, excuse my voice. I'm a little, uh, what's the word, Magu? What's the word when you have like a, your voice is a little. Also, excuse the voice. I'm a little husky today. I lost my voice yesterday. But before we get into this bar, let me go over the nutritional facts here. So uh, after website is saying that it's a 22 grams of fat, four net carbs, which is obviously keto friendly, really nice to have. Uh, protein wise is nine grams. So there's actually more fat on this one than uh, protein. So I'll take what I just said back uh, about being a protein bar. It looks more like a fat bar or a fat bomb or whatever you want to call it, but it's a, it has a lot more fat than it does protein. Also for the ingredients is this it has almonds and erythritol and then some stuff that I can't pronounce. Let's get into it. You excited? Estas lista, estas lista? Ooh, okay. Okay. No, espera, huele. Okay, huele. It smells like almonds, which it should, because it's made out of almonds. The texture is a little bit like, but it's like chocolate looking. And uh, I see the almonds. I do like the smell. It's not really super intense. All right, so let's try it. I give her a piece so she doesn't complain. Oh, it's nice and hard, I like that. Yeah, as I mentioned on my previous taste test, it's hard to find something crunchy in the, mm. bueno? in the keto uh, realm. Oh, wow, I really like the crunch. You want some? Ah, you want some, mama. That's really nice. Taste is good. It's not super sweet. It's not super sweet like a lot of the other protein bars that they add too much uh, sweetener in it. This one's just right. The almond flavor is really uh, earthy, nutty, and so it really goes well with like sl the slight sweetness. It breaks apart easily, but it's, it, is, um, it is nice and crunchy. By far the best part about this bar so far is the crunchiness. The flavor is good, so that's uh, that also uh, kind of adds to it. That's what I'm on. Wow, it's really good. It got messy here. You probably need a plate to eat this one. If I'm being honest, the packaging on this is not great. It looks a little old school. Maybe that's what they were going for. The back looks a little better, but the front de definitely seems outdated. But they made up with the crunch. They made up with the uh, flavor. I do taste a little bit of the sweetener aftertaste, but it's not terrible. Not like, especially not like before, we're kind of getting used to the uh, alternative uh, sweeteners. I did forget to mention, but this is one serving, so this is uh, four net carbs. I think the $3 price tag is worth just by pure crunch alone. If you look at the front too, it says that uh, more crunch, less carbs, which is very accurate. I really like that bar. I'm probably gonna order some of those. The crunch is amazing. Te gusto? No te gusto? Por qué no? Oh, she doesn't like almonds, so I guess she didn't like the flavor that much. She too. Do you like the? Por qué te gusta? Chocolate. She likes anything chocolate, I guess. Megu, did you like it? That's it. Good, she says. Good. <laughs> That's why she's not on camera. <laughs> All right, so that was actually pretty, pretty surprisingly good. Uh, I definitely recommend this one. I'm probably gonna buy it right after this video. Just, hey, no seas cochina. So that's it. The only thing else that I wanna add is that it's nice to have a bar that doesn't have that chewy consistency that most of them have nowadays. I think that's why this bar is so surprising because that crunch is really nice and it's hard to find in any keto products besides pork rinds or something. 
All right, so that's it. Thank you for watching. Let me know in the comment section below if you can think of any other keto products that have that type of crunch because I really like that and it'd be nice to have more options. Uh, if you like this video, hit that like button. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel. I really appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.